right? And they were gone from there. Now, is it possible? This is part of meditation. What we are doing now. Is it possible to for the senses to operate as a whole? To look at the movement of the sea, the bright waters, the eternally restless waters, to watch those waters complete with all your senses. Or a tree, or a person, or a f bird in the flight, a sheet of water, the setting sun, or the rising moon, to observe it, to look at it with all your senses fully awakened. If you do, then you discover for yourself, I am not telling you, I am not your authority, I am not your guru, you are not my followers. Followers are the most destructive people, and the gurus too. If you, have, if you observe this, if you observe this operation of the whole senses acting, you find there is no centre from which the senses are moving. Are, are you trying this as we are talking over together? To look at your girl, or your husband, or your wife, or the tree, or the house, with all the highly active, sensitive sensi senses, then there, in that there is no limitation. If you try it, you do it, and you'll find out for yourself. That's the first thing one has to understand, the, the place of the senses. Because most of us operate on, on partial or particular sense. We never move or live with all our senses fully awakened, flowering. Because, as most of us live, operate, and think partially, so one of our inquiries into this is to ha to for the senses to function fully and realize that the importance and the illusions that senses create. Are you following what this? And to give the senses their right place, which means not suppressing them, not controlling them, not running away from them, but to give the proper place to the senses. This is important because in meditation, if you want to go into it very deeply, unless one is aware of the senses, they create different forms of neurosis, different forms of illusions, they, b they dominate in our emotions, and so on, and so on, and so on. So that's the first thing to realise. If when the senses are fully awakened, flowering, then the body becomes extraordinarily quiet. You have you noticed all this? Or am I talking to myself? Because most of us, forced 
our bodies to sit still, not fidget, not to move about, and so on, you know. Whereas if you, if you, if all the senses of functioning healthily, normally, vitally, then body relaxes and becomes very, very quiet. If you do it, do it as we are talking. 